Hello friends. Let us speak in this question. Now the HR question, the most important question, what salary you are expecting? What salary you want? Or what salary how much you rate yourself? So this question is actually very important. It's a turning point. It's a turning point whether you will get the job or you will not get the job. You will not get the job. It's actually a blow point. Okay. It's nothing but a blow point. So this question need to be handled very tricky. As soon as you enter the interviewer, interview, sales job is nothing but job interview is nothing but a selling process. Selling process of what? Selling selling the selling what you sell you sell a product right right now in job you are selling your service what you are selling you are selling your service understand who are the best salesmen best salesmen <coughs> are the person who first sell their product sell their product in the mind of the purchaser in the mind of purchase then afterwards they quote the price afterwards they quote the price so if you are the smart person if you are the smart person you say don't take this salary question at the starting stage of the interview or in the middle of the interview take this question at the concluding edge of the interview right first let fix your position that you are getting the job right so uh, so if the interviewer ask for example in the starting of the interview uh, probably after introduction then you just uh, postpone the question you try to postpone the question you say salary is not that much important to be discussed uh, now it's not uh, much matter of concern we'll discuss it uh, as soon as we finalize the interview okay if he is asking at the starting of the interview and uh, try to take in the final session of the interview uh, never uh, keep in mind never s never speak yourself about your salary never speak yourself about your salary you you don't say first you don't say first for example, if you'll say, uh, sir, I want 50,000 rupees per month and the job was of 70,000 rupees per month, then you might lose that 20,000 which the company was going to give you because of your speaking, because you spoke first, right? That's why keep in mind, you don't say first what, you, what, what salary you are expecting. Second thing is that you, uh, you should you should uh, second thing is that now speak about salary don't say what are your salary requirements you speak about uh, you if you want to ask then you can ask what the what the positions what positions pays you say what the, there should be company norms see always each and every company has got its own norms for example the accountant is having 8 to 10000 clerk is having 5 to 8 thousand this is the range which is fixed uh, salesman is having 13 to 15 thousand uh, if the general manager is having 15 to 18 thousand or uh, <coughs> or any storekeeper is having 3000 to 5000 all the ranges are fixed according to the positions so you can ask the range uh, what uh, the position gates they so that you can get the idea what is your requirement and uh, what position pays so you don't need to confirm on that it is best to bargain the salary at the end of interview first let them understand what kind of qualities you are having what are positive things you are having and let them get convinced that you are the right person to get hired for this job 
convince them that you are the uh, best person suitable for that job. <coughs> Once uh, you convince them uh, that you are the best person suitable for that job, then salary for the private companies, I don't think it matters. I don't think it matters. You only keep thing in mind, if you are taking 10,000 rupees salary, then you should give 30,000 rupees output output to the company. If you are able to bring in 30,000, then only you are eligible to take 10,000 because 10,000 you will take 10,000 uh, indirect expenses company will bear and 10,000 will be the profit for the company, right? So always think that how much salary you are taking into three times you should be able to earn for that company. If you are able to earn for that company, then your, your job will be fixed. So this is the part of salary negotiation. Hope you got the answer to the question. Thank you and stay tuned.